fun. Um, so this this is gonna be the first video of the series that I am gonna be making about Scratch programming. Scratch is a block programming language, which is which MIT have made. It's gonna it's pretty easy. So yeah, let's jump into Scratch. So in order to down to to get access into Scratch, you will have to either um make an account or download it. In order to make an account, all you have to do is type scratch .mit .edu. That will directly put you into this place. Now if you just click join, then uh yeah sure. Then you'll make your own uh, account. And if you want to download it, um, the benefits I feel of downloading is that you can, it's offline on your computer. So in order to download, it's scratch.mit.edu slash download. Then it will have, when you download it, you're going to get Scratch 3. So you can get the older versions like Scratch 2 and Scratch Scratch 1.4. And yeah, so that's how you download it. Well, I've already downloaded it in my computer, so let's just open that up real quick. So here is basically what Scratch is: a group of box, a group of um, a group of little um blocks, which make a program as you can see so this scratch cut is a sprite a sprite is like a character that you can program and it will obey your instructions the backdrop is um, like just like the background if you click on backdrop you have a whole lot of backdrops as you can see here also, you have a lot, a ton of sprites because there's so many things that you can imagine here. So yeah. So now, um, now we have now. Now this is just the introductory video, so I'm not gonna really be talking really into details, but just for the basics. Here is like this is what the most important piece I think. It's this is called the green flag when the I this, like not exactly green flag but here it shows where when like when your command starts. Like if you click the green flag then all your commands happen. For example, if I have if I put the green flag and I have tons and tons of um command then uh you and as soon as you click that all those commands happen that will control the scratch cut and uh yeah and then the second and then another thing i want to really mention is is these this is motion this is the motion section this is this is this is um by far in which i've uh, known this is on the first column because i think that's the most used so they have very basic functions for the cat to do, like move 10 steps, turn so and so degrees, uh, point in direction, and etc. So basically, motion is just um, to show how the cat, um, what the cat should do. Looks uh, um, like how the sprite, in this case the scratch cat, should look. Change size by 10, set size, uh, just say, simply just say hello for a few seconds, think for a few seconds, uh, switched costume, backdrop, and etc. I'll be talking about backdrops and costumes later on in the series. Sound is, um, basically like making sound. Events. 
when things happen. This is a section where you can find the when green flag click. Control is sort of like, uh, um, mainly it's like, um, if, then, uh, until, forever, how long things happen and, uh, in this case, just rests. And the end stop all, and you have other com a bunch of stuff. Um, here, sensing. So sensing is um, like the computer is gonna s sense from the um, details from sc the scratch cat. Like, for example, like for, let's say um, the distance shot to the mouse pointer. So the computer is gonna sort of like figure out how far the, the scratch cap from the cursor is going to be. Uh, and here you have a bunch of operators which you can use to um, do a bunch of math. Variables, uh, variables I'll be talking about later and yeah, that's basically it. So, I mean, it might not seem a lot, but I'll just open up some program I made from the, the ping, it's a ping pong um, thing and you can actually do good with it. All I, I ha, um, the ball's pretty fast so all I have to do is I have to make sure that this block um, manages to hover over this, I'm um, not hover over but not touch the lava as you can see on the bottom side. Oh and it touched the lava so it said great game over. I mean, uh, yeah, Scratch is, um, I would say it's, uh, it would be the beginnings of programming. Like, it's a bit hard, but it's a bit easy once you understand most of the blocks. So, so far, I hope that you're, uh, you're enjoying it, and I hope that, um, everything's gonna be well after this, and I'll, guess I'll see you in the next lesson.